While I nodded, nearly napping, suddenly there came a tapping, as of someone gently rapping, rapping at my chamber door. Tis some visitor, I muttered, tapping at my chamber door. Only this and nothing more. Hey everybody, I'm Robin. And Miko. And we, we are, are Wander, Wander Open, Open Roads. Today we are at the Poe Museum in Richmond, Virginia. And if you haven't already, please be sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell to receive notifications when we post new content. So today we are at the museum for Edgar Allan Poe, who was one of the most famous American writers and poets of the 19th century. He is best known for his po poetry and short stories, uh, particularly his tales of mystery and macabre. And he is widely known as one of the early fathers of the detective genre and also of science fiction, which is near and dear to my heart. This museum is located in Richmond, Virginia, because although Poe was born in Boston in 1809, he spent his formative years in Richmond and, and also attended the University of Virginia later. Going through the different rooms and hearing all the spooky tales. So yeah, that black cat just kind of freaked me out. But hey, we're having fun. As you can see, there are multiple buildings on the Poe Museum grounds. They do offer guided tours daily at 11 a.m., 1 p.m., and 3 p.m. that's free with admission. Now, it does cost $9 to get in for an adult, but with everything there is to see, it's definitely worth it. One interesting bit of trivia is that the name of the Baltimore Ravens professional football team was actually inspired by Poe's famous poem, The Raven. Poe actually spent part of his early career in Baltimore and is buried there. We really enjoyed our time here at the Poe Museum. There was so much to learn and see about Edgar Allan Poe. Yeah, and if you're a fan, it's definitely something cool to see. And one thing that was really interesting also and, and, and neat was that the museum is actually housed in the old stone house, which is the oldest standing home in Richmond. So that was cool as well. Thanks for joining us and we'll see you next time. And join us on our next journey on Wander Open Roads. Be sure to check out our selection of travel apparel at shopredsquare.com and our Etsy shop. Links will be in the description. Thank you.